Hi guys, welcome to Karen's Corner. It's been such a long time since I sat down and made a creative video. <laughs> Last year there was a lot going on in my family. Um, long story short, we found, all found out that we're autistic. <laughs> and um, it took a lot of adjusting and, and getting to know yourself. And Anyway, in December I decided uh, I'm gonna take a month off YouTube. Because these videos take me uh, about half a week filming, editing, uploading and stuff. So um, it's a lot of work, but I love doing it. But it was just a bit too much. So I decided, you know, a week, uh, a, a month off and... I did upload some Christmas videos and I did do December daily videos. So anyway, I had lots of creative videos on the shelf at that moment. Um, in November, I made loads of videos. I just felt like it and I just sat down and made a video. So I used some of those videos and I used those videos in January. And um, then at a certain moment, I thought I'm just going to do one creative video every week because it is too much. <laughs> so from now on, it's just on Monday, it's a creative video. On Saturday, there's an Alice in Wonderland video. I've got loads of those on the shelf. <laughs> and uh, in between uh, the clutter video or whatever. Anyway, so I wanted to start um, creating again, but I just didn't feel like it in January as well. And then in the beginning of February, uh, I was at my mom's, as we do every Thursday. We've done that for 35 years. <laughs> every Thursday, um, we get together and uh, spend a whole day or an afternoon together. And um, I was there again that Thursday and uh, she was ill. She wasn't feeling well. She was very tired. And I called for a doctor and it turned out she had COVID. And well, I managed to get her into, uh, an, I think you call it a nursing home. She didn't want to go to the hospital. And she wasn't really that ill. She was very, very tired and um, just not feeling well. And um, anyway, uh, I went into quarantine directly. So I was at home for a whole week, but I didn't feel like crafting. Normally, I just start crafting when things aren't going that well. It's just what I do, what I like to do, just get start crafting but now it really didn't feel like it so um after a week i uh, luckily i got uh, tested negative and um i went to see her and the next day she was gone she was just gone anyway i don't really want to make this a very sad video but my mom just got pulled away from us and we didn't see it coming even though she had covid we di really didn't see it coming we thought she'd be okay she was a very strong woman but anyway um so uh, after that, I really, really didn't feel like uh, crafting. I did upload some videos, or maybe I didn't. I don't even know if I did. It was I still have one video left from, uh, I think, November. Or maybe it was the one I did in January. Uh, uh, I have one video left on the shelf. Or I already uploaded it. I don't know. <laughs> That's how it goes at the moment. I have no idea what I'm going to do the next day or whatever. So anyway... I have a bit of a creative block. I really don't know what to do, but I feel like I want to do something. And I've been thinking about what shall I do? Well, you know what? I'm just going to play it safe. I'm just going to make one of my favorite pages, a dilution page. I have these new stencils. These arrived in February, beginning of February. I haven't opened them yet, so um, I might use these. And of course, I'm going to take a page out of this book. Oh, it's almost full. And... Um, I am going to take all my favorite things, my favorite colors. My, f uh, I'm just going to do a page that's just really simple. I'm not going to look at the pages. Uh, well, I wanted to use these colors because look, <laughs> my favorite colors. But I'm not going to look at the pages that I already did. I'm just going to take a page and I'm just going to start and do what I like to do. A background, just a simple, simple page. Background, uh, some stencils and then a picture and a quote. And that's going to be it. So let's just get started. I've got these. I'm not sure if they still work because I haven't used these. I wanted to um, put water in all of them and stir them and make them a bit better again, but uh, I didn't. So uh, let's see if, what they look like when I open them. First, I need paper. And ta-da, I've got paper and I've opened these. Now these really need stirring and water and stuff, but uh, not now. <laughs> So um, I am going to start with pink because, you know, I like pink. I'm not going to think too much about it. I'm just going to start. <laughs> okay, I really need to, need to stir this. Well, it still works. It is um, a bit 
a bit creamy. Well, it's a nice start. It is a very dark color now. So what I do love about these jars, I've told you before, is that it's so nice and creamy. Now, this is a bit too much. This one, uh, I need to put lots of water in. And I really need to do that one day, but it's just something I keep forgetting or not wanting to do. Anyway, um, it's still okay to use. It's You have to push a bit harder to get it on the page, but, but look at that. Now the new bottles, like these ones, are really fluid and they are so nice to use, but they're not creamy. They have, they don't have this much pigment. I don't know what it is, but anyway, this is not how they're supposed to be. That's the downside of these jars. If they're, if they're half full, then um, there's too much air in here and it just starts to dry out. Now you don't have that with the bottles. But it is nice and creamy and I love that. <laughs> so I've got a nice and creamy background. And I think I really need to dry it because it's so, so much paint. <laughs> now what do I do with the last bit? So, um... Just get your finger pink. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna clean this one. Wait, wait, I've got this. I've got my um, leftover paint magazine and it's just getting better and better. A bit of pink over here because there's a lot in here. But I don't want the pages to be too pink because I have pink on every page. <laughs> Because I like pink. Okay, the rest I'm just gonna clean under the tap. I am going to spritz a bit of water in here. No, I'm not. I don't have water. Uh -huh. Oh, it's right in front of me. Lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of water. And I hope I can remember to stir this. But I know myself, I won't. Guys, you have no idea how great it feels to do this again. I miss this so much. Oh, I love doing this. <sighs> okay, now I've got a pink background. Now what? <laughs> I'm back. I'm saying, now what? I don't know. So like I said, I'm going to play it safe. So I'm just going to put this back in here. And I'm just going to use one of my favorite colors and one of my new stencils. I have no idea. What are, what are they? Well, new. They've been here for two months, but... <laughs> okay, these are nice. And these, you know what I do with these? These are to put in here and then put in the cover and take with you when you're on a journey or whatever. But I like to cut them in half. <laughs> what? What are you doing? Oh, this, these scissors need to be cleaned. Because then I can put them with the rest of my stencils. It's just way easier. I don't travel that much. Who does these days? Uh, and when I do, I just have that little uh, pouch with me with all my stencils in it. So I like to do this. Now guys, uh, I've been on this journey last year. Uh, when I found out I was autistic, I learned a lot about myself. And um, you know, it's really awesome to be autistic. I really don't mind. There are so many nice things that I do or see different than other people that I actually kind of like. But it also has its downsides. And one of them is I can't start things. It's so hard to start things. Now, everyone has that. But um, I think. <laughs> but um, yeah, I have it a, a bit more extreme. It's so hard to start something. So that's why I am today just going with um, what I usually do. And that's just use, uh, use stencils. Um, I'm just, sorry, distracted. Um, you know, background stencils, picture, quote. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay. Um, I really like to use a border. So I think I'm going to... Going. I already put water in this one. <laughs> I haven't even used it. I'm a bit distracted, guys. Do I have some stirring sticks? If I don't, I'm going to use something else. I don't. I need to get up to get stirring sticks. I really don't want to. So I'm just going to use this. It's the same one. So, oh well. <laughs> Here we go. It's been a while, guys. I just need to uh, figure out how it, how I did this. How I did things and, and how things work. And, oh well. Here we go, let's just start. 
Uh, that's. Uh, I think this is for everyone who has uh, trouble starting again. Just do your favorite stuff. Just do stuff you really like to do with the colors that you love. And it's okay if it is the same as you always do. Who cares? It's just to get, you know, started again. Oh, I love it. I love it. Oh, I missed this, guys. And I missed talking to you. I really did. I love, uh, cr oh, love crafting and just, you know, babbling a lot and talking to you. And it feels like we're crafting together, and I absolutely love that. Okay. Here we go, a bit over here. That's a bit too dark, but who cares? Ooh, here I go again. I don't care. <laughs> yes, I do. This needs to be a bit more like this. And then a little bit over here. The rest... It's going to be borders. So I'm going to clean this one later on because I know I had baby white wipes normally, but I don't know where they are. It's really been three months since I really, really crafted. Like I said, I did one video in between, but okay, clean enough. So now what? Oh yeah, I wanted to use borders. These are awesome. I love these stripes, but I do want something cheerful. I love the flowers flower border these are for a different time and I do love the <gasps> dots and these I love everything shall I use black which you normally do or shall I just go for something else this is in front of me oh sorry guys this is in front of me I'm going for really dark really really dark okay now at this moment any moment my husband can walk in the door because they have been doing groceries and uh, well that's a bit sad because normally they also do groceries for my mom so it takes them a bit longer so now um he's uh, back home earlier they earlier uh, sorry sometimes my words won't come out right at the moment something that's been tr uh, troubling me lately here we go troubling now it's been, well let's just say words are difficult at the moment <laughs> Okay, flowers, I like it. So shall I do predictable stuff and do flowers over here? Yes, let's do predictable stuff. Um, anyway, um, what I wanted to say is that normally they do, my husband and my son bo do groceries together every Saturday. And because I'm filming this on Saturday, I love it. And then um, I'm just going to do this. Hard talking and doing this <laughs> together anyway so they are doing uh, groceries and then they bring some to Tim and then they normally bring some to my mom and then they come home but now of course they're not going to go to my mom again so uh, they're home a bit more quickly so uh, I have to be aware of the fact that at any moment now my husband can open the door hello and then I'm still filming <laughs> So uh, if you hear that, it's okay. Get used to it. Because I probably won't be finished with this one. Is this going all right? Am I doing this okay? <laughs> well, you know, today you, I can't go wrong. Everything is okay. Everything. Except this corner. It's a bit crooked. But oh, well, who cares? I don't care. Oh, I missed saying that. I really do. <laughs> I always said, I don't care when something goes wrong. You know what? I really don't care. <laughs> okay, so that's the border. You know what I want to do. I want to clean all of this again. And then um, I'm going to take out my Faber-Castell. And get some pictures. Uh, you know, a lovely person or so. So, see you in a second. Ah, feels good. Okay, I dried the edges and I forgot to turn on the camera. But I'm just going to start to trace some of these with a white pen. Uh, this one. And my husband just walked into the garden. So. <laughs> okay. Just gonna do a few. Let's see if I can do it before he walks in the door. <laughs> it, look, it sounds as if I don't want him to come in. <laughs> oh boy. Um, 
this flower. What? This is a metallic gel pen of no brand. It has no name. I think it's from that cheap store that we have, the Action. And guys, sometimes this one really works well. I have so much trouble finding a really nice gel pen. This one really nice. It works. It works well. So, really nice. Never used it before. Is this enough? Almost. You probably won't see this. There's probably going to be a figure over here. So you probably won't see it, but oh well. Okay, I think this is enough. Just a little bit. And I might add some later. So, where are my... No, I wanted to go around this with purple. Am I going to do that? Hmm. I wanted to go around it with purple to make the edge darker. But you know what? I want a, I want a bit of a happy page. So, well, that was fun. I didn't use it. Okay. Um, pictures. Let's get some pictures. I've got all of these. And I'm just gonna take some out randomly. I really love this one. Oh, I really love this one, to be honest. I can also use stuff like this. Okay. Oh. <laughs> yes. And my husband is here, so I'm gonna stop filming. You hear that? He's waiting. Can I open the door? <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> See you in a second. Right, so I've got some faces over here and maybe a body and maybe a dog, because why not? Um, took them all out of here. In here I have all my Diane Reevely, um, what do you call these? Collage sheets. <laughs> so I took some out. That I had already fussy cut and um, I fussy cut these two. I do like this, this face but also like this face. <laughs> so uh, this can be a body. <laughs> I do like her better. Um, okay I'm just gonna try something. So I do like this one better. I'm gonna do this real quickly and then she need legs. I had legs some oh here. <laughs> this might be weird. <laughs> oh, that's just weird. Um, right? I can do this as a wait. I'm gonna make this one a little bit smaller. I just like this. What? I like the color. So if I do this and then this, <laughs> then this. It's like a really bleh, skirt. It's okay, but I like it. So, am I? How am I going to do this? Underneath or on top of it? Or and I have no idea if this is gonna work, so it might ruin the whole thing. Because I really love the color of this thing. Okay, this like this. Oh, it is better. Can I do it a little bit more like a V-shaped? thing or don't <laughs> might not have enough neck for that oh dear what did I do can't even see what I did okay she looks a bit like ah it's too tight <laughs> oh well and I do love this flower somewhere and I want a doggy. I want one of these these dogs. This one, this one, or this one. Okay. I do love this cutie, but I like this one as well. I don't know yet. Uh, this is weird. I like it. I like that I, oh, as well. What's this? So these are all little things I had already fussy cut, and um, oh, and I found these quotes. I got these from Lisa. In my package, if you've seen that video, if you haven't, go check it out. Um, I have no idea what's on there, but there might be something. Let your imagination flow. There's probably a nice quote on there. Um, I like this, whatever it is. Short arms. She doesn't have any arms. I really love this. Oh, this face. <laughs> okay. She's gonna have an awesome hat, but no arms. Do I mind? Do I mind? I don't know. 
can do this. <laughs> Why not? Why not? I'm going to use this one. I'm going to cut it in half. And then I'm going to do this. I always like to give people their hands on their backs, so then you don't have to draw or cut or whatever the hands. I mean, it's on the back, on their back. So back, back, <laughs> back. <laughs> it's on the back. Look, awesome, right? She's got her hands on her back. I think I'm gonna go for this lovely combination. I should be a fashion designer. <laughs> okay, and then what do I do with the dog? Ah. Uh, I really do like this little fella. I'm gonna fussy cut it. Maybe put it on something. Or this. Or this one. Just put it on top of it. Um, it has nothing to do with this uh, very fashionable person. But it is a cute doggy, so why not? Gosh, I've missed this. I really have missed this. And I've watched the crown too often because I say, gosh. <laughs> if you've seen the crown, that's what Diana says, gosh. And I like that so much. So apparently now I say it too. Oh, gosh. Okay. Uh, a little doggy. Okay. Well, this is not bad. <laughs> I ha I'm gonna have it laying on this but i'm gonna make it a little bit more like this so it has a bit more room oh cute doggy it is nothing it's not supposed to be anything it's just a dog on top of this <laughs> whatever it is <laughs> okay i think this is gonna be it and maybe i am going to am i going to do that I just fussy cut it. I am going to fussy cut this beautiful little bird. I just like it. <laughs> this is such a weird page. Now I hope there's a quote that I can fit. So I'm going to glue this on, leave the bird for a second and see what, uh, what quote I'm going to use. So first a cute little doggy. And uh, guys, this is so nice to do. I've missed this so much. And uh, I'm not really thinking about it too much. Normally I overthink this way too much. Now I just, you know, I think, mm, this should actually be over here. No, it should not. It's okay that it's over here. And let's just, ooh, it's a lot of glue. Let's just glue the dog on and let's <laughs> make this wonderful fashion statement with this beautiful person. <laughs> okay, ooh, my glue is... Uh, Hasn't been used for a while and it's not used to it. Um, how do you do this? You start with the legs, I think. Ah, no, wait, E. Way too much glue. <laughs> it was a bubble. Okay. And now there's no glue left. Okay. No, come on. Oh boy, yeah, here we go. Okay, so let's start with the legs. It's really awesome. And then a skirt. <laughs> this is a skirt. If you didn't know, this is a skirt. And uh, a really long skirt. And then this on top of it. Now uh, I need to put the head, oh and the arms underneath. How am I going to do that? As usual with great difficulty. I'm just gonna do that. Oh my gosh, that's so old-fashioned. That's so <laughs> like an old lady. <laughs> okay, I like it. So the arms are gonna go underneath before I really glue it on. That's one. And another arm. Isn't it awesome? That's when I draw arms, I also always draw it like this, just on the backs. So you don't have to draw the hands because I don't know how to do that. This is a, this old lady fashion. <laughs> and then this lovely head on top of it. <laughs> oh, I love this. 
Oh boy, guys, why didn't I do this? Why didn't I just start doing this? Like I said, that's a bit of my trouble. It's so hard to get something started. Here she goes. Ta-da! Look at me! <laughs> and then a lovely hat. Because, you know, with this lovely dress, you need uh, a lovely hat. So I hope I can still make it fit because ooh, it's a bit to the side of the page. And I want this on top of it. She's too tall. <laughs> I should have made her skirt up a bit a bit shorter. <laughs> um well I'm just gonna cut off the little edge on top. Do I still I had another one, a little one. Ah, here it is. Do I still want it over here? Or is it a brooch? Oh, I like this. I've no idea what it's supposed to be, but it's fashion, you know. <laughs> gonna be all the rage. Brooches like this and a hat like that. And on a cute little puppy. Okay, I love it. So now I'm going to go around this with one of my very cheap aqua markers. So this is an aqua marker I bought at the Action, which is a very cheap store. And I just love going around this. It makes it pop a bit more and it's so easy to do with this. So I'm going to speed the rest up. And over here to make her dress pop a little bit more. And a bit over here. And I forgot that I have shaky hands. <laughs> so it's not as nice as I want it to be everywhere, but oh well. Okay, I like it. A bit over here. And a little bit over here. <laughs> what do you think? Oh boy, it's weird. I love it. Okay, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna do the bird. It might be too much. Uh, I hope there's something on here. It, it's very small. Oh, these are bigger. Creativity, creativity is joy. I really love that. Paint till you faint. <laughs> uh, put your, put you in your art. These are actually kind of tiny. Um, well, you know what, then I'm just going to use the bird. I'm just going to use this. So, uh, like I said, I got these from Lisa. And thank you, Lisa, because I can use this. And I am just going to put it over here. And I am going to go around it with a black pen, if I have one. Yes, I do. I'm just going to do this. Although the pen doesn't work anymore, but actually it's okay because that looks nice with the quote. So, a bit scribbly. You know I like scribbly. I do like it, so now I'm just going to put the bird on top of it. And then, guys, and then, this page wouldn't be a page of mine without, let's say, together. <laughs> Lots of dots. So I am going to use Dutch as Dutch. I keep saying Dutch. I am Dutch. I'm going to use dots and not Dutch dots, but dots from the USA. Dots that I got from Lisa. Look at it. It's nice. So this birdie doesn't have a uh, shadow around it because this birdie is flying. This lady needs a bit more ground to stand on. Otherwise, it's flying as well. Okay. So, all that's left. Now, all that's left to do is... Dots. <laughs> Lots of dots. Okay. So, I have so many dots now because I got loads of, uh, of them from Lisa that it doesn't want to close anymore. Mm, I can do sparkly that you don't see because, again, it is a busy page. Or I had these ones. I had these lovely dots from Lisa. Um, but they are quite a lot. These little ones. Oh, look at them. They're so awesome. Oh, look at it. Look at them. They're amazing. So I am going to put... This is a bit empty, isn't it? 
Wait, first I'm going to scribble a little and then I'm going to put some dots. I'm going to write, this is my first page. See, it says this is my first page. And over here I'm going to write, uh, in a very long time. I don't write that at the moment. It's just, I pretend that I'm writing this. And I love it. I would take an <laughs> exclamation point. Uh, a bit more scribbles over here and over here. <laughs> and here. Scribble, scribble, scribble. Okay, I like it. Now a little bit over here. Scribble over here. Oh, I can write backwards. Wow. Scribble over here. <laughs> okay, now for the dots. Um, um, I want one of those wonderful... Oh my gosh, I thought they were flat, but they are really, really... How can I show you? I thought they were flat, but they are really, really bold. Look at them. <laughs> they look like they are flat. This is awesome. So, uh, do I have more pages to make? Just a few. You know what? I'm just gonna do it. It's gonna be hard to make those pages with these huge dots on here. But I really don't mind. I'm going to put one... Near the doggy. Where am I going to put one? Or on here? <laughs> now the dots are difficult. Oh, come on. I'm gonna put one over here. A huge dot. I love it. Just one. I think I'm just gonna do one of those beautiful special ones. These are flat. Okay. So these are flat. They're still big and huge, but they are flat. And I do like them. So one... It's a bird dropping if I do it over here. <laughs> so one over here. Nah, don't like that. Oops. Uh, oh, no. His nose. <laughs> and and just one over here. There are lots of dots in the corners. That's not lots of dots, that's just a few dots. Two of them actually. So I need I need a few more. Come on, it needs to be a page, one of my pages, so I am going to use uh, a light color. I want pink. I really want pink. I always want pink. That's why I don't have any pink left. Uh, well, then I have these three. Um, where can I put one that it's not too much? But, you know, still a lot. Over here. A dot over here. And a bigger dot over there. And a smaller dot over here. I think it's finished. Well, at least uh, not enough dots. What do you think? <laughs> I'll do that later on. Does it need anything else? No, it doesn't. Just one thing, a little scribble over here. This page is finished. <laughs> Guys, look at it. It is a very happy page. <laughs> I love the fashion statement that this lovely person is making. Uh, <laughs> it's really awesome. I think I'm just going to leave this over here. It might... Nah, it might... Is it going to be okay? I'm just going to leave it for now. Just going to leave it over here. If it's going to tear, I'm just going to cut it off next time. But I do like the way it looks. And this is a happy page and I'm finally crafting again. Like I said, it's been months and it's so nice to ah, finally do this again. And this is my favorite, favorite page to make. Just some paint, some stencils and weird pictures on it. And um, a bit of scribbling, lots of dots. And that's it. And a quote, creativity is joy. It really is, guys. It really is. Because I loved doing this. I hope you liked watching this video as much as I loved making it. I'm so happy I'm finally crafting again. I already said that five times. But I really am so happy that I'm finally crafting again. <laughs> so I would love to know what you think of this page. Do you see yourself wearing something like this? Because now I'm a fashion designer. Look at it. It's amazing. <laughs> as long as I don't have to wear it, I love it. <laughs> I love the glasses. 
Anyway, that was it for today, guys. Thank you for watching my videos and thank you for sticking with me and um, for all the lovely uh, comments that I got from you uh, the last few weeks. And, well, let's see if I can make a video every Monday. So all that's left to say is, please subscribe if you're not already subscribed and hit the notification bell. And I would love a thumbs up, guys, on my first video in months, even though you saw other videos. But anyway... And all that's left to say now is... Groetjes uit Holland. Greetings from Holland. Bye.